death over an embarrassing incident on a beach. Please don't do this to me. Are you serious? Say witnesses saw her using an adult toy on the in Georgia. Look at this. Got a guitar. I guess it's a homeless person's thing. It looks like a guitar, made guitar song. Ugh. Please enjoy tonight's feature film. Turn left onto South College Street, then turn left. Wow, 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 we're in Savannah, Georgia. Kind of close to it. Flanders Powell Funeral Home, where I was sort of around the area when I found this out. Um, let's take a look around. Anyway, last year, about a year ago, um, I seen this on Inside Edition where there's a courthouse. A woman by the name of Christina I guess they said was out on Savannah Beach she was experimenting with herself with a toy I guess and I saw the uh, you know there's video of uh, the police uh, badges there where I guess uh, she said she was she thought she was on the beach by herself she was totally covered up and she used the uh, Toy to experiment with herself and such. Um, so anyway, I guess she got arrested. Went through, uh, you know, a couple restaurants and that with handcuffs on her. And happened to find out just when I was around the area um, on Inside Edition. About a year later, she was found dead with a gunshot wound um, to her head suicide that's what they said so what they're suspecting is that she done it because of embarrassment um very sad situation i wish she would never took the knife off uh, you know, i wouldn't care what people think or say i really don't think she'd be embarrassed at all um you know people say it's the cops fault and stuff the cops did the right thing they arrested her um you know, I think they just did the best they can. But anyway, um, as you can see, we're behind the funeral home here. This is where she was cremated, 35-year-old Christina. But anyway, um, it's not the cops' fault. I think they did the best they can. But I think what happened is the family that called the police on her were eavesdropping on her is what I think happened. I don't think the kids seen it. Or if they did, the family kind of like you know, showed the kids. I think they're from a far distance. And fortunately, uh, you know, what happened is uh, she took her life. It's really bad for the woman. And it's not a big ordeal. If it was me personally, I would have never called the cops. Or what I probably would have done is just said, hey, there's people around. You know, do that stuff somewhere else. Um, the point of the story is, is, you know, people call the cops on the stupidest things. It's not like she's out there showing kids. Um, really not a big ordeal, you know. So, someone took their life over it, and this is where she was cremated just recently. So, it's just really bad. I feel really bad for the girl. So, um, anyway, uh, it's a nice little town around here, kind of hanging out in. So, we're kind of going around Atlanta. I just got some new houses down there. Maybe I should buy one. I want a little house just like that, but I need a garage, though. So, anyway, uh, I probably imagine that's where she's cremated right there. I don't know anything about, uh, 
cremations. But it's just a heartbreaking story. Um, you know, like I said, I'm pretty sure what happened was a pair a family of idiots probably were eavesdropping I don't know, from a far distance and just decided to become assholes and call the cops on her. I will let that be. Uh, I do believe her. I think she was covered up and she probably thought it was private, but the best thing to do is do that stuff in your car uh, behind closed walls or something because you don't know who's lurking these days. So it wasn't like, uh, you know, she was building a bomb and someone's eavesdropping. That was something different, but... Yeah, it's just a very sad story to what happened. Oh, I feel real bad for the family and, and stuff. Uh, I'm pretty sure she was embarrassed about it. If it was me, I wouldn't be embarrassed because there's people out there that do worse things than that. That's just part of life, I guess. It's better than having a kid, I guess. So you see, I'm in Georgia here, and there's the funeral home. Nice little funeral home. Kind of pay my respects. Uh, I don't know, like I said, I am almost 100% sure that family that did that was just doing that stuff on purpose. Uh, as I show you the uh, camera of the cop there, uh, just don't know, man. It must have bothered her for about a year. So she's only 35 years old. Hey right, guys. my respect. Uh, I don't have too much information on her. It's a nice little person. It's a cool man. Alright, you ready? I hope you enjoy tonight's film feature. Please make sure and check out my other videos. Have a great day.